Hello everyone, the heavens opened earlier and the rain shows no inclination to stop. We're looking forward to the game anyway. My name is Derek Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man Stuart Robson. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say with good reason, it's Denmark up against Finland. Thanks Derek. Well both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. And the starting lineup for Denmark. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Simon Kerr plays with Andreas Christensen in central defence. Pierre Emil Hoybier plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And here's the Finland team. Well, it's a defensive looking lineup, but if the wing backs break forward, the midfield can get close to the front pair and the front two can link up with each other. They should still cause problems today. And now they get the ball rolling. Mikael Damsgaard. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Kasper Dolberg. Hoybier. And now Vass. Takes the shot. Well, closed down straight away. Vass. Here's Eriksen. It has to be! Well, from that sort of range, he really should be testing the keeper. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. Marcus Fors. A creative look about this. And options in the centre. Mikael Damsgaard. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. Ericsson, surely! Well kept out. Short corner it is. Ericsson. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Blood. Bogian Palo. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. 
Well, decent effort, but not troubling the keeper too much. Another perfect position to read it. Wonderful chance! And a goal here! There it is! They've done it! Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. He knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Daniel Vass. And it's still on. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. He has teammates around him. A wonderful intervention. Space afforded him. Now well, just the tackle that was needed. And providing width. Options in the middle. Well read to ease the pressure. Skov Olsen. There will be one minute added on at the end. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Good refereeing, waiting for a natural break before administering the caution. Corner kick taken by Christian Eriksen. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Kasper Dolberg. Mikael Damsgaard. Well, great read there to intercept. O'Shaughnessy. chance and up and turned onto the woodwork
And out of play for a Finland throw. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. For Jan Palo. For Jan Palo. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Kasper Dolberg. Oh, a lovely ball. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and they just need to keep the concentration. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Two nil here, and the ball is moving again. bad challenge and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next well he's gone into the book well he was late and he deserved a booking for that well we're into the final half hour and good work from Finland to win back possession. Well, there you have it. The hosts have had so much of the possession. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball, which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Delaney. Kasper Dolberg. And that puts them in position. And there it is! Three goals in front now. An immense performance. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection. And he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Into the final 20 minutes. For Jan Palo. Giving it a try. Puki. Well, that's what Christensen is all about. Good read. And teammates around him. Gives it a go. And a goal. He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Underway again with the score at 3-1. Skov Olsen and Hoybier with it
He continues his run. But the danger averted for now. Ericsson. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And that's the hat-trick! Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Puki. That's useful play. Very quick thinking there. It's a corner. Trying to pick out a teammate. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Hoybier. Dolberg has it. And that is the end of the contest and not a happy outcome as far as the visitors are concerned. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out.